Hello and welcome back to No Man's Sky. I'm Cat Trans Gamer, and I've I've been doing a few things offline. As you can tell, I've got 1.7 million dollars or units now. 1.7 million units. Um, I have yet to upgrade my. I've upgraded my exosuit a few times. I'm up to 17 slots. I have not upgraded the starship. I'm still utilizing the. Um, the one that came with the pre-order. And my multi-tool has been upgraded a little bit, not much. But I have decided I'm going to take this in a different route. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get a little bit more money. And then we're going to go ahead and do that first jump. Once we do that first jump, we're going to see about purchasing a new ship. Once we purchase the new ship, I'm going to go ahead and take on the role as a space pirate. Which means I'm going to get most of my money from basically attacking freighters and other ships I see. But, so like those guys there, I'll come in and attack their cargo, take what I can, and then get away before I get killed. At least that's the goal. We'll have to see how it goes. But I want to get another load of um, iridium. Fill up all these slots with iridium. And fill up all these slots with iridium. Plus I want to get... I got to get a little bit more of that right there. What, what do I need? Let's see. I want to install this. So I need some more iridium and a little bit more iridium. So... I'll go get that stuff, and uh, if it's not too long, I'll just fast forward through it all, but if it's too long, I'll just go ahead and skip, and you'll catch right up with me when I got a full um, cargo hole full of iridium. I just gotta remember which planet had all the iridium on it, let's see. I'll at least show you a little bit of what I've been doing. Um, I know how to check. Let's see here. It was a planet with no... So we got Planet Gamer. It had like no wildlife on it. The planet I'm looking for. So it's either Trans or Gamer. Let's see here. We've got Planet Trans there. I don't think it's that one. Planet Cat. So let's go check out Planet... Well, where is Planet Gamer? Hmm. I don't know where that planet went. We'll head over this way a little bit get a different view. Oh. Too close to the space station. Okay. Let's get a little bit away from it and we'll boost. There we go. Come on. Still too close. There we are. So, yeah. I've decided I'm just going to go the route because everyone else out there is doing the, you know, missions and stuff. I'm just going to have fun with these recordings. We're going to see how long it takes for me to die. Okay, brakes. Now let's get a nice... KTG1, trans. There's Gamer. Let's go over to the light side. There we are. Alright, so... I'll see you guys in a few.
going around just mining up emerald. Sorry, I said iridium earlier. It was actually emerald I was going for. I mean, look at this. I've got four, seven, eight, nine, almost ten full stacks of emerald, of 500 each. And each stack's worth 137.5 thousand units. So, that right there, I've got well over a million here. I've got probably, oh, well, I'd say I've got enough here to make us 3 million units total in our bank account. Well, let's go check it out. I will go ahead and fast forward, heading back to the space station, and we'll sell it. Alright, so I don't recommend running into the space station. It does make it a little hard to, to control your ship. Let's go in upside down. Ah. Ah. Oh, and there's some ships here already, but we're just going to go in to the trade terminal and sell it all there so we can sell it all out of our ship at once. I mean... Yeah, my exosuit's completely empty of it. Sell items. Starship inventory. No, oh, come on. Look at that. 4,875 of emerald comes out to a total of 1.378 million in total price and I'm getting a plus 2.8 percent galactic value so that's a bonus there we are oh it's just a little over three million and I was able to upgrade two more slots into my inventory that uh, crash I, I found a crash ship and unfortunately it was only a 15 slot ship and my ship is a 16 slot ship so it wasn't really worth getting you know switching over to i mean it's nice finding crash ships they're free you don't have to do anything but repair them but uh, journeyman now i gotta go through all the milestones of the money accomplishments oh looks like i've uh, completed it actually Wow. But, yep. Let's go ahead and pick our star system. We're going to go ahead and jump to. Now, right now, I can only jump to the yellow stars because I haven't upgraded my warp drives. But uh, there's upgraded warp drives that will allow you to go to the red stars or the green stars, depending on which one you select. So let's see. Two planets. Why not? We're only going over there to attack the freighters anyways, right?
Alright, three million, let's see. I'm gonna sit here and look at a couple of uh, ships, and we'll, I'll pick out which one I want. And then I will see you guys in the next episode. I'll show you guys my new ship, and uh, we'll go ahead and attack some freighters out there. And hopefully the space police doesn't show up and attack me. But we'll see what happens. I do need, um, let's see, how much titanium do we have? Not much. I need to get, I'm actually going to make a pit stop and uh, pick up more titanium. You do that by, easiest way to get titanium in the game is to go down to the planet and attack the sentries. Honest truth. You attack the sentries, you blow them up, and you get titanium plus technology from them. So, but I'm going to take a look at these ships, see which one I want, and I will see you guys next time. If you liked what you saw, please subscribe. And uh, you want to see more of this, subscribe, and uh, give me a thumbs up. What not? Drop me a comment. But until next time, bye!